In the spring of 1945, after surviving the Holocaust, Leon Weinstein spent six months bicycling across Poland in search of his daughter, Natalie. Years before, in a desperate attempt to save Natalie's life, Leon had left her on the steps of a police station in the hope that someone would take her in and hide her from the Nazis. I went into the police station and I said, do you remember in 1942, Christmas time, they brought into this police station a, a baby? He thinks it, wait a minute, yes. They brought in the baby in the chief of the police station. They got no children, they took the baby to the house. And the baby was there about three months. Later, started to be very strict and the Germans put up advertisement. They will find a Jewish baby or a Jewish body in some Polish house. They will bury the house, they will kill the people. The commandant from the police took the baby and put it into the Catholic convent. And I went from place to place where, the, where, where they told me. And I was tired. I said, no matter what it will take, how long it will take, how much it will take, I, I have to find it. With each passing year, I, I become more and more awed with my father's good sense and grateful for his ability to see beyond what other people saw in situations. My heart fell apart. I couldn't find it. I come back with a broken heart, and I come out to the, the mother general, and I told her I couldn't find it. And I take a look there in the corner, and says a nun with a baby on the end. I take a look, I said, this is my baby. I see this man, and he had beautiful boots on, brown boots. I had never seen a man dressed like that. I, I, I recognize in her eyes. And I think it was the intensity of his smile and obvious interest in me that really made me feel like something very special all of a sudden. 